What's going on, my YouTube people? It's your boy, 0x11, and I have returned. The end. No, I, I am back uh, officially, and you guys are probably wondering, Hey, Zero, where you go? You okay? And for some reason, you guys were all Asian women in my head there. That was, that was all of you, by the way, just bawling your voice together and asking one question. Is that... I, I doubt that's humanly possible. But anyways, um, no, I've actually been in Southeast Africa feeding starving children peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Yeah. So what have you been doing with your time? Word. No, that actually never happened. Although, given the opportunity to feed starving children peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, you better write yourself a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I would feed starving children peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Mm-hmm. So, with that being said, now that you know where I uh, was, no, I'm just kidding, um, no, uh, somewhere along the way, I lost some focus, um, I started to care about things like uh, subscribers and losing subscribers, and oh, my life is so sad, I lost 15 subscribers today, let's never make a YouTube video again, and I realized that I was just being a really stupid asshole, and um, but I don't care. I just don't care. Um, you know, when I first started this YouTube thing, I said to myself, if I can get 50 subscribers, I'm the man. Like, that's all I wanted. Like, I didn't expect to have, like, 800 subscribers or the washing machine in the background trying to try to fuck up my mojo. But I'm not going to let it because I've done this commentary, like, 47 times, and I've probably said the same things, like, 30. So I'm just going to let it go and pick off this piece of cracker that's on my keyboard. I was having those cheese crackers earlier with the peanut butter in them. They're pretty good. They're pretty good. Yeah, so uh, essentially I just I just told myself, you know what, I, I didn't come here for fame or popularity. I came here to make videos to entertain a few people, and if a few people is all I entertain, good. So be it. If I entertain thousands one day, eh, I entertain thousands. Um, you know, I feel like it's easier to interact with you guys too when I'm a smaller channel. I'm not saying that I love being a smaller channel. I'm just simply saying that it is easier to interact with you guys. Um, like for example, that guy that trolled me on my last video about a month ago. I interacted with him. How you doing, buddy? You out of the hospital yet? I'm just kidding. I didn't put him in the hospital. He'll write me some douchey comment. Uh, you didn't put me in the hospital. I was right here next to my keyboard, fapping to gayporn.com.erotica.gayporn. Porn, porn. Gay, 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 gay. I got your number. Uh, yeah, so that's that. Uh, the only other thing that I really kind of wanted to mention today, and it's certainly not going to take me like eight minutes to talk about because this is like an 11 minute video is um, if I don't mention it you guys are going to put it in the comments and I'm sure you guys probably have already heard about it but uh, this Coney 2012 thing um, yeah you know what uh, somebody told me that I should mention it in my video to promote awareness of this thing and uh, if you haven't seen the video just go watch the video um, uh, about what I'm talking about but uh I'm probably going to explain it anyways. I don't even know why I said that. Now I'm thinking about it. You got me thinking now. Good work, guys. Good work. Um, no. Uh, essentially, it's this this guy that's uh, been beating and killing children for like 30 years. He's like, um, I want to call him a dictator of this other country or, or some sort of leader. I, I don't know. But um, now there's like a new debate coming out um, that this company that's uh, trying to promote awareness of this guy is essentially like a fraudulent company and they're like they've already like assassinated this guy like people have and this guy's dead and now this company is just trying to make money or profit off of that and um, I don't know it's shit like that that just makes me think like I don't know who to believe anymore. I grab my head, I squeeze it, I'm like, fucking migraine, it hurts. So, um, yeah, I, I just, I don't know. Like, stuff like that bothers me. And, um, 
you know, obviously I'm a, I'm, I'm totally against this guy, uh, whether he, he's already dead or isn't dead. Um, but I'm also against this company if they're, you know, they're just trying to profit, but supposedly only 30% of your donations are going to this, um, foundation or to help the cause of this, uh, their posters or whatever. And another 70% is getting pocketed. Uh, that's what I read. You can't believe everything you read. You can't believe everything you hear. For example, a little earlier I was telling you guys what happened to me, and I, I told you I went to Southeast Africa. And you may have believed me in the beginning. It's true. Think about it. Rewind back if you'd like. I'll wait right here. You back? Good. Yeah, weird. I'm just rambling at this point. Um... Ramblin' Man. What was that? Was that an Alabama song? Alabama Hot Pocket. Do not Google that. And definitely, definitely do not image search that. You're doing it, aren't you? How disgusting is that? You guys still doing that? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, um, yeah. So, I want to talk about, um... Let's just drop the Coney thing, because I, I really don't know where to go with that. And I feel like if I take a side, somebody's going to be like, Zero, did you know that one in four people are pooped on every morning when they walk to work? And these are the type of things that we don't worry about? Zero, did you know that when Whitney Houston died, they talked about it for like a week and no other news was mentioned? Yes, yes, I know these things. Why don't you give me your random facts? And uh, th that's really what happens, though. Like, you take a side on something, and somebody hates you for it. You're not entitled to opinions anymore, because somebody's going to hate you somewhere. So I'm just trying to stay out of it. And does that make me a bad person? Nee. I don't think so. So uh, w some of my plans, I just want to talk about the plans for the channel. Um, I want to do more of those YouTube journals. Uh, I want to do uh, maybe some play-by-plays. Uh, which I haven't done in a long time. I also want to do more how-to videos and uh, obviously more commentaries kind of like this where I just talk to you guys and um, just kind of give you the traditional shit, which I guess is cool, um, you know, because I feel like some of you guys like just the traditional stuff. And when I kind of sprout out like a weird flower or plant and try something different sometimes you guys are like that was so stupid i don't know what wrong with you zero you really need to check your brain for a tumor or something and i'm like no i don't have a tumor in my brain i just you know trying to do something a little different <laughs> but um some of you guys love that and some of you guys hate it and i feel like um I don't know. There's uh, once again. I mean, it's kind of like a, a win-lose situation, and um, you kind of have to take your pick. I mean, the traditional stuff like this, the commentaries, is kind of like um, good because you play it safe, and when you try something different, um, you take the risk of everybody hating it. Now, fortunately for me, when I've tried different things, um, a lot of people like it, but there's a couple of haters out there. Which is fine, don't get me wrong, I, I don't think that you guys are going to love everything that I do, do, which is totally understandable, but um, I wish you did, I really do. And uh, actually when I went back and uh, seen a uh, comment on my play-by-play, -play, I believe it was the play-by-play, -play, it was actually the guy that hated my video last week! Well, not last week, it was actually my last video. It was like seven weeks ago, I don't know, it's been a long time. Yeah, but either way, I'm watching you, mister. I see what you're doing. You're coming over here to hate my shit. I am watching you. I'm like, big brother. Isn't that that government thing where they, they say the government is always watching you? It's creepy shit when you think about it. Just think about it. For a second, just let's, let's sit here, have a moment of silence, and think about that. Yep, creepy. I'm creeped out. So, uh, we got hit by solar flares. That's another thing. I feel like this is the longest frickin' video I've ever done. I don't think it is. What is going on? I'm throwing a grenade. Do we already get to the part? Yeah, I think we already got to the part where I dropped a Predator missile on a recon drone. Can you say frickin' awesome, Zero? Frickin' awesome, Zero. <laughs> <laughs> that, 
That was apparently your guys' voice that time. Uh, I do apologize, because that one kind of seemed like a... Like you had Down syndrome or something. Sarah, it's awesome. <laughs> it's not funny. It's not funny. I'm going to stop laughing. Okay, so the video is wrapping up. Thank goodness, because I was honestly running out of shit to talk about. But uh, yeah, got hit by solar flares. Look that stuff up, too, because that's scary. Look that up after you watch that Coney stuff and figure out things for yourself. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what else to say about it. But uh, until next time, guys, we um, should have something up in a few days, I'd imagine. Uh, I'm going to peace on out and uh, keep it in your sneaker or something. I don't know. Peace.